So what do the tonsils do and do we really need them? People have been told that you don't really need your tonsils, okay? They're an extra organ from birth and you can do fine just without them. Well, the people that are telling you that usually are in the business of removing them. Um, you don't have any extra organs that you don't need, okay? You need all of your organs. They have a purpose. They wouldn't be there unless there was a reason for that. The tonsils are primarily involved with protecting the microbes from getting down into the lung and creating a respiratory infection. In fact, removing the tonsils increases the person's risk of getting a respiratory infection. So there's an activation of T cells and they start creating antibodies and they start to start this immune response to protect you. You also have uh, lymphatic tissue in your armpits as well to protect um, microbes from going down into different extremities. And when we're talking about the tonsils, we're not just talking about one. There's four different tonsils, or you can look at them as like this tissue, lymph tissue, that's located in the back of the, th uh, the throat area, a little higher up, a little lower, and they're basically there to kind of protect microbes from going deeper into the body. Now, the two remedies that support the lymph system to make sure that they can do their job a lot better, zinc and vitamin D, okay? Now, the other thing that I've observed with people that have chronic tonsil infections or swollen tonsils, they're almost always on a diet that's very high in sugar or high in dairy products, okay, like milk. And lastly, you want to add in fasting. You may even find that your, your appetite goes away and your body's naturally trying to get you to fast. The fasting is really important in strengthening the immune system. Thanks for watching. Hey, if you're liking this content, please subscribe now and I will actually keep you updated on future videos.